Michael Bobo, do you not- Oh, uh, sorry, those are- Uh, welcome in. Seribot is essentially, uh... An independently made bot that essentially keeps catalog of any known follower bot accounts or any spam accounts. And they automatically ban them if they type in the chat. It's cool. Imagine not being first. Yeah, imagine. Guys, I was first. Man, but crazy. Kobobo actually first for once. Did you get notifications turned on? Holy. Every single word? I know, it can't be real. <laughs> hi, Hacker. Hi, Crystal. <laughs> oh my god, hi, Kimari. Tom, get your notepad out, Kimari. We're gonna learn some English. Dude, my Twitch notifications have been actually broken. I only have notifications on for two channels, Squeaks and Hassan. I haven't been getting notifications for four days. Um, I think it's because my Twitch mobile app updated four days ago. So I think maybe it's just a bug in the update. So I've just been like refreshing Squeaks' stream. But then I was like, oh, I'm going live today, so I can't watch the stream. Such. Yeah, so everybody, if, if Twitch notifications are bad, just follow my Twitter. Yours have been good? What? From my main channel, the notes work fine? Okay, good. It's just, my, my Twitch notifications are broken from my phone. Maybe it's because I have a Samsung S9 and I'm not using my side bitch phone for Twitch. I don't know. I'm also, um, you guys can hear the music, right? Because I'm capturing audio slightly different, so I'm listening to my own music in my headphones. I'm listening to... Um, Nightmare by Set It Off. Thank you, Kobobo. Imagine actually answering the streamer. <laughs> I haven't done my homework? Well, get your notepad out right now. This isn't my time to die. And then I'm not getting faster and faster. I dive onto the floor. Sorry, I'm live. <laughs> I sing to myself all the time. And my sister teases me. Is she a bad sister? <laughs> you live in my head. I gotta find the page we left off on. Activet. Oh, right here, Aquaman. We'll wait a few minutes. Would it be a good sibling if they didn't tease you? I guess, but I'm not like mean to my sister. Unless. Guys, I have so many snacks today. I'll show it on camera in a second. But since it's basically 4 o'clock, I'm gonna have my dinner now. I have the leftover cookies from earlier. I'm not gonna eat all six cookies, don't worry. But I have like, pieces. And then I have egg salad sandwiches. Peach Kit Kats? Oh, did they sell that in the States or did you get that internationally? Because when I went to the store, um, I saw Bertie Cake Raspberry. Those gotta be international, right? Or maybe you got it at like an Asian mart. Because I went to... I don't know if I can leak the name because I only have one location <laughs> near me. Um, you got a, Okay, you got a Korean market. Okay. Because when I went to an Asian mart, it was a Chinese store. Um, but they had all types of Asian goods. They had lemon. They had coffee, Kit Kats. I wanted to try them, but it's like, I don't want to buy a whole bag, you know? I wish they would sell, like, the individual ones. Or, like, you know, in America, they have, like, the larger individual Kit Kats, where it's, like, a large bar. You make me wanna come through quarter after two just to put it down on you. I've gotten so much better at that verse. Um, 30 more seconds, everybody. Um, everybody in the chat room, put your favorite word that starts with A that's not ass. <laughs> or, wait, is there any other bad words that start with A? Or asshole. Or A N U S. Someone got automated. <laughs> I allowed it and then I deleted it just to be better. <laughs> that sounds like something you could see 
in what you call it, Captain Underpants books. Um, we'll wait another 30 seconds because I want to eat my sandwich. <laughs> the mods allowed it. The mods is me, you dumbass. I mean, lovely chatter. Authentic? Thank you. Genuine, authentic, real. Oh my god. I, I got scared. Reading the word. Because I saw the A-U and the T-I-C. I was like, oh my god, autistic? <laughs> Um, face came on. Hello. Yo, good good, morning, good evening. Good afternoon. Hope everyone is doing well today. This is a bonus sub goal stream. We hit our sub goal on the main channel. And <laughs> um, thank you, Titans and Mac. Mac wanted to do an art stream, so we're here we're doing calligraphy. Um, today, for my snack, and by snack, I mean dinner, I have a. Sorry, the overlay is wild. Alright. Wait. Is it frozen? Why is- what? The camera froze. What the frick? Oh no. Okay, everybody. It was working, I promise. Don't worry, don't worry. <clears throat> oh, there it is. Okay, hello. It's back. I don't know why it- it, it's this is the good capture card. Anyway, I have a the sandwich is sliding, but I have a egg salad sandwich this morning. I made over medium or over. Well, look at this angle. I made um, boiled eggs. This I, I boiled them for eight minutes. That way the insides were a little bit jammy. It has kale. I did season the eggs. You can maybe see like little flecks. I put parsley, paprika, and cause I just that's why I like to season my eggs. A little bit of pepper. And then provolone cheese. And this is a brioche bun, because we had leftovers from one of my burgers. Yes, I did make a half a sandwich. Guys, I had a small lunch. I had cookies for lunch. Those buns are bodacious? Yeah, I was gonna get sesame seed buns, but my sister doesn't like it. And brioche are usually... I think they're fine, but it's definitely better than, like, a regular ass bun, right? <laughs> Richmond, no, they would shut up. Shut up. I, I get all my groceries from, like, a gross- or a discount grocery store. Because Costco is a scam. Uh, but they weren't that- they were like a dollar more than the regular cheapy bread, so I don't care. You know, if I can't get my little chips, then I will- then I will get a nicer bread. I told myself I'm gonna buy like more quality things if I can. Because, you know, I gotta treat myself. Okay, I'm gonna take one more bite. I'm gonna mute when I chew because it's really loud when I chew. The sandwich is so good. I don't get why some of y'all don't like eggs. It's not that bad. They're pretty healthy. Oh my god, you want to hear something funny? So my friend sent me a meme. I I'm not going to show it on camera because I don't want to leak DMs accidentally. But it was essentially a chicken and then next to them was somebody at a campsite making eggs. And the caption was, do you think the chicken knows? And I was like, well... It's kind of like how we humans don't instinctively don't know what a burned human looks like. How do you think a chicken is going to know what a burned egg looks like? And then my friend was like, true. And then I was like, yeah, you know, just shower thoughts. And they were like, morbid shower thoughts. I'm like, true. No, but seriously, like, chickens in general are pretty dumb. So it's like, would they know that they're like, that there's like a boiled egg as their kid? It's also kind of like pigs. They just eat slop. They don't- I don't think they know. Like, if they were fed bacon, I don't think they could tell. It's kind of like if- uh, since none of us are cannibals, wink. Uh, Twitch staff, I'm kidding. <laughs> it's kind of like we don't know what, like, people taste like. Okay, uh, nobody clip, please. Uh, mods disable clips. <laughs> but, you know what I mean? Does that make sense? Step one? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Huh? Yeah, thank you. 
Okay, you know the little Nas X song called Star Walkin', the League of Legends collab song? I kind of like it. How'd you feel if a chicken called you dumb? I'd be like, valid. I mean, my brain is big. That does not mean I'm smart, right? Okay, one more bite. I was trolling. Did the chicken or the egg first? Eggs, obviously dinosaurs. What mods ban crystal? What the fuck? Huh? <laughs> okay, let's get started. So if you don't know what's going on, yes, the title is not clickbait. I I will be writing every single word in the dictionary. All all seven hundred plus pages, okay? Last week we finished off with Akuman. We are probably gonna do, uh, let's see, it's about 4 o'clock now. I'll probably stream for two hours. Because I, I kind of want to get a head start on my homework. Because I have an appointment on Thursday, so... Yeah. Okay, Chatters, would you rather... Okay, sorry. The song was just really good. Would you rather I do a shorter stream on Thursday? Or do a longer game stream on Friday? Because I have a few one-off games. One takes four hours, one takes one and a half hours to beat. So it's either we can do an um, hour and a half game on Thursday or a longer game on Friday. Yeah, I think Friday is better. Because I feel like more people watch on Fridays anyway. Also, is anybody on spring break right now? Because mine starts this Sunday. <coughs> I'll, I'll have stream again tomorrow. But I think Friday is the way to go. Yeah, if it's longer, then I can run more ads. Um, face reveal at um, 69 followers, everybody. <laughs> okay. Oh, I need my pencil. Yours is two weeks long. Mine is only a week long, unfortunately. But I'm kind of glad because then it doesn't push my graduation back, you know what I mean? I should have drawn the dots earlier, but I forgot. Your school district is on strike too. I know there's a strike going on in LA. We're gonna go back to your clipping era. Are you gonna be cool Boba this month? Okay, let's get started. Let's hope I don't throw it. the color palette for today is gonna be blues. I've decided I don't think I want to use Tombos. I'm gonna use my Calier pens because I have like five of each pen because <laughs> I only use certain colors from the set so. If I go through these, it's fine. I don't really want to bust up my tumbos too much anymore. Because a new set is 500 buckaroos. I don't know much about it. Wait, so does that mean you're out of school? How does it work for, like, the kids? Because, you know, I think striking is cool. And I think any workplace should have the right to do so. Especially if it is a union workplace. But how does that actually affect the kids? Because we never had a strike in my district. We got close a few times, but... They just didn't do it, because our the people in our district are wimps. Oh, they still give you homework? I hate that. You know, if the teachers don't work, why should the kids work? 
You guys should strike. <laughs> massage of those points on the body stimulated in acupuncture. That's a move in Pokemon? Acupressure? I've never played Pokemon. Should I be cancelled? Or should I be... praised for being anti-capitalist and not giving in to Nintendo? Even though I love Mario. <laughs> Acupuncture. The Chinese practice of inserting thin needles through the skin at specific points. Especially to cure disease or relieve... Pain. I'm not light, I swear. Yes, you are. You're 17 minutes late. You're fired next time this happens. Yeah, I did play Violet. <laughs> are you gonna play Pokemon Night if we hit the mobile game sub goal? Wait, I forgot mobile. There was Unite on mobile. But there's other Pokemon mobile games. So, but yeah, I can add Unite to that stream. Did you ever beat it? No, I got bored. I got to like the snow section. I got bored. Does it think my favorite part of the Scar Scarlet game, Violet game, <laughs> Scarlet, the Violet game was just like exploring and finding new Pokemon. Otherwise, it was it was kind of boring. I think the mechanic of Pokemon is just too repetitive, boring. Oh no! Oh no! Oh! Oh, oh my god! Oh no! I'm so so. I'm so sorry. I misclicked. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> you can't chat if you're an audio listener and you can't see the chat! I accidentally banned Crystal! <laughs> oh my god! I can't- I can't- <laughs> oh. oh my god! <laughs> because- <laughs> So- what happens if I don't move my mouse? Um, it disappears from the screen, so the only way to get my cursor back on the screen is to click. And I had my cursor over the chat room, so you just got unlucky. And my cursor was over the band button on Crystal's name. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. Yeah, guys, the title is real. It is not Clue Bait. <laughs> oh my god. But just crystals going rapidly in there. What have I said? What have I done? Oh my god, no. <laughs> okay, chatters, chatters. Sorry, I'm, I'm laughing so loud, my mic is peaking, isn't it? Um, <laughs> no, it, like I said, crystals literally gonna, gonna become a hate watcher. <laughs> um, oh my god, I can't. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. You're fine, Crystal. You won't get banned on the man. It's, it's okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, you guys know, if I ever had to ban somebody, I would do it quietly. I wouldn't giggle right after. You would- that'd be an indicator that it's fake. It's kind of like messed up how Twitch bans work, is the- Because uh, like, when you get banned, you only can't chat, but you can still watch a stream. Because like, there's been a- A few streams that I can see somebody's banned in. But I can still see them in the user list for drama. And I'm like, ooh. I'm gonna have a- I'm gonna have another bite of my sandwich. I think- <laughs> That'll get me back on track. 
I'm so sorry. Guys, I'm sorry. Don't cancel me. Look at the gradient. This is a perfect gradient, though. No, don't stream snipe me. The next the next time we might play Mario is on my birthday. If he stream snipe me on my birthday, then you're mean. That's very mean. Okay, it's not like I banned you on purpose. Okay. I've never been banned from a channel. Even accidentally. So you know, Crystal, this is a blessing in disguise. Is the team tourney actually happening? If we get can have enough people play, then yeah. We'll do that for the birthday stream. Oh, what was I gonna say? I was gonna say something else, but I forgot. Oh, now? Now that I've clapped Crystal accidentally, now they'll always have something to, to get at me for. Like, they're always gonna be like, anytime I talk shit, they're like, will you ban me? <laughs> My permanent record is ruined. <laughs> you know, sometimes the authorities mess up, okay? And be glad that I didn't jail you forever. <clears throat> Wanna be on the good team? Be on my team, easy. Okay, back to work. Acute. <laughs> Sharp or pointed. Okay, the next word is sus, but it's not bad, okay? A cute mom walks by. What are, what are you talking about, Meg? Are you just living out your fantasies in the chat room? Put the best player and the worst player on the same team? Yeah, put me and Tanuki in one team. Is that what you're trying to say? <laughs> it's a lot of bad things. Oh, a cute mom walks by the word. Oh. Sick clover. A drug used to treat herpes. <gasps> guys, my crush is the hottest person alive. You guys will never find out. <gasps> what if it turns out I had like a, a wife this whole time? Wouldn't that be crazy? Abbreviation for advertisement. My whole world movie would change forever. I mean, true. Then I would be lying this whole time. But then it'd be lying to protect my privacy. Mm. You haven't told anybody about you having a crush IRL. What if one of your friends is watching? What if they're watching? Yes. Waiting for you. AD. Abbreviation for after death. Or after date. <clears throat> oh my god, hi Kim. Clocking in late again. 
Oh, how's the gym? Did you fall off the machines again? <laughs> yeah, because, like, since the chat updated, some chat colors are the same, and it's very confusing for me. Can't you see? Yeah, I wish everybody could have a different chat color. I came here to bully mods ban Kim for real, for real. We just hit the ADs, guys, finally. You only did arms today? I've been debating if I want to get, like, just some simple dumbbells. Because when I went to my friend's house, they had, like, they had a 15 and then a 25 dumbbells. And I, I can lift them up, surprisingly. So, I think I want to save up to buy a few. Because I was looking at some online, and they started, like, 30 each. And I was like, holy... So maybe that can be my graduation present. Smile. Yeah, but I could easily lift the 15, like, to my head. No, stop saying I banned you. Oh, wait, on accident. Okay, we're good. With him, I can't compete. Guys, if I lifted, all of your moms would be done for. Adage. An old familiar saying, adage? That sounds like a Twitch emote. <laughs> like a, a frog reacting to ads. Is Max saying we can feel their muscles? The dog, you? It's it's a ballet thing. It's a ballet move. No, Mac looks nice. They don't look. I don't think you look too young, Mac. I mean, I've only seen, like, chest up pics. But you don't look scary, Mac. Keelan does not look mean at all. They look like a, a sweet little kid, but I think they're older. I wanted to have a snack. How is everybody taller than me? I think <laughs> Kim's 5'1. I'm never gonna forget that. I need to. Dude, is, is this stream just gonna be shitting on Kim? First, they're unemployed. Now they're shorter than me. <laughs> I think Kim is here just to make me look good. Kim is no longer intimidating? <laughs> oh no. Mod check? Ice build. Egg salad sandwich. Dude is bursting. I'm here to be a joke, but you said you're having fun! Kim deserves better? Okay. What other streamers do you guys watch? And do you chat in their streams? Or do you only typically chat here? And the main channel, of course. <laughs> How are you six foot, Crystal? The picture you sent for the meme making stream, you literally looked ten. <laughs> Obviously it had to be years ago, but... <laughs> six foot? Oh my god. Yeah, I know you watch um, in because I saw the emotes that you and Mac have. Would you guys chat? I 
finally watch you? Thank you, hacker. That's crazy. Cause like, hacker's been watching for almost a year, and you've only watched my stream in a year. Wait, so Kim and Mac, do you see each other in Ian's chat? <laughs> I guess like, hi. You're like, hi, Mac. That's kind of cute. I mean, I think it's a lot easier to be, like, more chatty in a streamer who averages less than 10 viewers. Because in general, like, the streamer will actually read your message. I I'm, I'm kind of different because, like, I kind of, like, ignore shit. <laughs> but not that I don't- I read everything in the chat, I just don't read it out loud. You've been watching that person for three years? Who is it? Can you leak? I'm legit a joke. Stop it. No, you're not. You go to the gym and shit. Oh, his streams are more inactive? Okay, that's great. One more bite. I'm Kazu. That name sounds familiar. Oh my god, partner streamer? What about me besides the song? Um. Hmm. I gotta think. Cause like. I don't. I don't mm. Cast me. I don't watch any small streamers. I don't watch Scootish as much anymore. It's because, like, to me, for me as a viewer to enjoy a stream, I like to be a chatter, okay? And Scootish's chat is not funny. <laughs> it's just not funny. And it's hard to, like, try and be funny if everybody is just talking about games and not trying to be funny. So I don't watch his stuff. I don't chat and he's chatting anymore. I like to lurk. Yes, guys, the title is real. It is not clickbait. Um, if you like the title, click follow. Easy. like us yeah because like you guys choose you guys try to be entertaining mm. I think it's because the way I formulate my commentary it's it's encouraging a back and forth when a lot of small streamers small meaning people who are not partnered or recently partnered they don't necessarily They'll just read everything, and that's just boring. But I, I pick and choose, because I have the understanding that stream has to be entertaining for both like live viewers and then um, VOD watchers. Because VOD watchers, they can't interact, so you have to make sure that your banter, your commentary, can stand on its own as an audio listener. Not just having to look at chat, too. I come here to be degraded? What? Are you- is- Did Titans take your account? Guys, why do I have a whole bunch of masochists in my chat room? 13 plus chat. Get back to work. Oh, that is so. Sorry, make sure I'm using the right color.
Yeah, I don't like being degraded. It brings back trauma. Mine's well the clip where my mom said she hated me. <laughs> Dude, I'm I'm still surprised I told that story on a main channel stream. I was genuinely surprised. I was like, why am I sharing this? But then it's like, I don't give a fuck. Crystal! First you play footsies and now you're fantasizing. Stop it. Guys, this topic is for like a Discord server, not a Twitch chat. <laughs> Let's be honest. Adamant. Determined. Strong willed. You need to go to Sunday school. <laughs> Yeah. Should should I host a church service? You went to a Christian school for nine years? Dude, I would lose my mind. <laughs> Change of topic. <laughs> yeah, we love religion. You hate pickles? Me too. I don't like vinegar at all. It's like too intense of a flavor. Oh my god, okay. So I got crumble yesterday, right? And then on the way home... I stopped by Panera. Now, Panera, I think is fine. It's all right. I tried the steak and cheese melt, and on their menu, it doesn't say what's in the sandwich. Thank God I don't have allergies, because I could have, I would die, because they don't list their ingredients. Um, but the steak sandwich had a horseradish sauce. Horse, hor, <laughs> what? Horse radish sauce. And it tasted like wasabi. Because you know how like American wasabi is just horseradish? It's... It was not good. Because I took a bite and I was like... <gasps> I was like, what is this? And like, there was like barely any meat on it. I felt it scammed. I paid $13. No, I paid $16. Because I got a little cup of mac and cheese. And then a half sandwich. And 16 bucks. And I tipped $10. Because I was nice. But... They were like out of everything, so I was like, "Can I get a smoothie?" And they were like, "We're out of that smoothie." I was like, "Well, can I get that smoothie?" And they're like, "We're out of that too." And I was like, "Okay, I guess no drink today." But Panera is way too overpriced. It's way, way too much. I mean, I, the only thing I like is the broccoli mac, which they didn't have. They're always out of it. Anyway, back to work. Panera's decently priced bagels on Tuesday. Okay. Yeah, the Panera is like a 30 minute bus ride for me, so it's kind of like a treat. Oh yeah, the Panera breakfast sandwich I had one time was really good. <laughs> that being said, I didn't pay. Not fair. Something that's always kind of off-putting to me whenever I do go to a bakery, whether like a chain or like an actual bakery, is when they have like bread just out, like in a case or in a counter that's not like fully sealed or closed or in a bag. I'm just like, how is the bread not going to get hard? I don't know. I mean, hopefully they sell it by the end of the day, but who knows they don't keep it out overnight. Adam's apple. The projection in front of the neck formed by the largest cartilage of the larynx guys my larynx is too long that's why my brain is too big oh my god hi baddie dude it's late for you huh go back to bed hi baddie can we get some yo's Be second best shatter <laughs> just kidding <laughs> your mom zabu yeah i was sucking on it last night oh uh, sorry that sounds very bad <laughs> mods wait apple can mean ass Okay, that's better. I was thinking of neck, okay? I was thinking of, like, an Adam's apple. And me. <laughs> it's real- yeah, it's real demon hours, you mean.
I thought that was a peach. Wait, it can't apple also be- Somebody look it up. <laughs> oh wait, Batty. If Batty's watching. Have you looked at the new 7TV update? I hate how the chat room looks. I downloaded an old version of 7TV. Because I hate the new version. I'm not watching so Okay, bye, Betty. <laughs> I, I hate calling out chatters directly. <laughs> That's what I get. Is the weather bad up there? No, it's pretty good. It, it's actually pretty nice out today. I should have gone for a walk during my break, but I was fixing my 7 TV settings because it was- It made my Twitch look like ass. It was- Because, like, with the new 7 TV update, it overrides all of the, um, Frank Your Face Z and Better TV chat settings you have. Yeah, the emote tab is ugly. So what I did is I downloaded the old version. It's, like, version 223 of 7 TV. Because there, there's a way to do it. Just look it up on, like, how to- how to revert to old extension version Chrome. But it was easy, it was easy. So, because it might not affect regular viewers because maybe your emote menu might look different, but for me, since I use chat highlight, there's so many different like visual settings, like color modes I used. Um, I, I It looks a lot better with the old version of 7TV. Because they don't have full integration yet with other extensions. Tutorial win, no, I'm not gonna leak. I'm not gonna show my uh, computer. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not gonna show it. Nice try. <laughs> Adapt. Adapt? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Excuse Um, Adapt. To make suitable or fit. Adapter. One that adapts. A device for connecting two dissimilar parts of an apparatus. Apparatus is a weird word to use. I still haven't eaten? Then go have a snack, Mac. Oh my god, hi, Lemon! Can we get some yo's? Yeah, go eat. Go eat a lemon! <gasps> Dude, I look away for one second and you guys are punching. Go eat or I'm unsubbing? No, Mac, you're gonna make me miss out on two dollars. I mean, five dollars, of course. Mac, come on, go eat. I will not eat until Mac eats. I will not finish my egg salad sandwich that is very delicious. No, Kim just Kim just skips their coffee that way they can sub to me. Just like I tell her to. Zooey mama. <laughs> ADC. Abbreviation, Aid to Dependent Children. 
I like how you guys will say like really mean shit and just be like, heart, peace I too love. That's some real friendship right there. Not between me and chat, but between chatters. To join to something else, as to increase in number or amount. See, if you guys keep shitting on Kim, the new chatters aren't gonna want to chat. This is how we scare people. But also, if you're a new chatter, just don't give us anything we can weaponize easy. Like to say you were a ripped Chad doctor. I can sense that your Pikachu fell. No, it didn't. I would hear it. Even though my headphones are noise-canceling, I would be able to hear the cry of my fallen loved one. ADD. Attention. Deficit or disorder. <laughs> I didn't <re> <laughs> I saw a disorder and I thought it was like something serious, but ADD, we all have that. Your Twitch chatter, guaranteed. Yes, guys, the title is not clickbait, it is real. You should follow the channel if you think it's funny. I've, I've never had Dunkin' Donuts. This is it good? Or will I become addicted? I don't. I usually just go to Starbucks. There was this one. Wait. There's a few locations in Washington. Wait, let me- let, wait, can I leak the name? Megphone streamer. Oh, yeah, there's only- <laughs> I can't leak. <laughs> there's only three locations. <laughs> I cannot leak the name. Because I knew it was chain, but it's only in, like, my county. Um... They had this lavender mocha. And it was just like a white mocha with like lavender oil and like lavender petals in it. Really good. It served a hot and cold really good. One of my coworkers put his hand in the tank of the men's bathroom and toilet because the chain was broken. That's unfortunate. Hopefully he does not have a girlfriend. <laughs> Moving on, another page done everybody. Dude, I'll, it's been 45 minutes? I'm actually stalling. How many words do you think you're gonna get in a stream? Uh, 21. When was the last time Lemon was here? Man, Lemon chats a lot. Because I'm trying to scroll up to see when the last time Lemon chatted in this channel, and I've been scrolling for a long time. In one stream, you sent, like, nearly a hundred messages, you crazy. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh my god, the last time you heard was November. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy moly. Jesus Christ. Well, welcome back, Lemon. <laughs> oh. Oh, where? Man, back in November was when we actually did art. Oh, where? Uh, chatters, exclamation socials in chat. Um, website coming soon. Follow my Twitter to keep updated. Yeah, imagine doing art. Imagine.
A den. A number to be added to another. Imagine having the motivation to do your hobbies. I mean, it's hard if you're working and in school. So valid. Like, if I... Streaming is essentially a hobby. I talked about this earlier. But if I worked, I wouldn't be able to stream. It's just too much energy, especially when I'm disabled. Uh, I'm not officially disabled yet. It's... I don't even know how I would go about, like... Like... Because, like, I have a diagnosis, kind of. Like, it's on my medical files that I have a big brain. But... It's kind of like... It doesn't feel like it's a... Because when I think disability, I understand there are invisible illnesses, which is what I technically have. But it's like, when I think disability, I think people who can't walk, who can't speak, who can't hear. So it's like, if I apply for a disability, am I going to be taking money away from the people who probably really need it or don't have as much support as I do? Shoutouts to my sister. So it's like, eh. I mean, I'm obviously like a bit away from applying. Because... Something that did come up when I applied initially was that I was in school because they were basically like, well, if you're in school, then you can probably handle being disabled, so you don't need money from the government. Smile. So I don't know. You shouldn't think of it that way. I know, but it's 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 hard because like I feel guilty. You know what I mean? Because like all I could think about because like just so many like if you take public transit, there's so many disabled people who use public transit, and all I can think about is. You know, they can't afford to have, like, a modified vehicle to transport them around. They don't have somebody who can drive them places, and it makes me sad. So it's like, why would I take away money from them? I don't know. Hopefully I'll be fine, smile, after some PT, but... Take it one day at a time? Thank you. Anyway, addendum. Yeah, I think I gotta get a new pen for this medium blue. Addendum. Something added or a supplement to a book. Damn, you only have 1700 points? Play more Mario Kart. <laughs> the person who has 98,000 points needs a new hobby. What if Mario Kart is their passion? What if they're a pro player? What if it's actually me playing Mario Kart under the table with my toes? Actually, don't picture that. I'm leaving? No, you're not. Am I not allowed to make one joke? One joke. I'm getting a snack. Yeah, I did ban you, and next time it'll be for real. Do I like Trader Joe's? No. It's overpriced as fuck. And all the little zoomers who don't know how to shop will shop at Trader Joe's and like spend all their money on overpriced shit that's like kind of good but not really. Yeah, it's always fun to, full of dumbass zoomers who are used to their middle aged mothers, higher upper class, who bought them a car, making them nice little treats at home. When I was little, my mom would go to, or she would take us to, um, Trader Joe's just to look at everything. And maybe buy some avocados. Yeah, Cheddar's, if you want to help support the stream, tip. Um, the money will go towards paying my student loan debt. That feels targeted. <laughs> maybe.
No, it's not targeted towards anyone. I was channeling my in inner, like, like, stand a bit. And in my head, I was arping as somebody who hates the work, the quote unquote working class, like, business owners. Okay, like the closest Trader Joe's to me. It's like a 40 minute drive. So it's not even worth. Almost done. Is that good for you? <laughs> no, I think me and Kim are the same age. I'm not 50. Guys, my birthday is next month. I'm turning 24. <clears throat> no, I would never do ASMR. Uh, ASMR streamers on Twitch get a really bad rep. You know, I love Amaranth, but I don't think I can do what she does. My tummy's way too big. That was awful. What? I got a police hacker. They've been watching for a year. Yeah, Shatters, don't leak your age. If you're a minor, don't leak your age. Poisonous European viper or related snake. <laughs> Kim's old. Oh, this is what all my chat room is when they see predictions. Or if they're XQC viewers. XQCO. <laughs> you should listen to the stream on speaker, everybody. Addict. One who is addicted to a habit-forming substance, behavior, or activity. Everybody's a Twitch addict, right? You guys love my stream so much. You have nice shoes, color mochi. <laughs> oh my god, I can't. Oh my god. Uh, just to remind everybody, we are an hour into stream, so it's time for me to tell you. If you're new here, click the follow button. Um, you get to type in chat. Ain't that cool? And if we had 69 followers, I will end stream and never stream again. Yeah, kind of weird that you said you like her shoes. I feel like that's kind of sus.
Addiction. The quality or state of being addicted. Were you almost about to say the word ads? No. On this channel, I know I don't. Because I can set up timers in the chat room that'll say, like, messages if I want to. So it'll be like, oh. Run an ad now, Megan. Or, oh. Tell people to follow, Megan. And whenever I do it late, it's because I, I miss the message. Yes, I read it. The channel is real. It is not clickbait. If you like the title, click follow. <laughs> people who use the pleading face emoji unironically scare me? Oh, no, Tacker. Just don't look at my Twitter. <laughs> I feel so called out by that one comment. I'm never gonna forget that. I think the pleading face is cute. Even when I'm texting, I use it normally. Am I cringe? Okay, can I just clarify? I am not a Discord kid. I am not. Oh wait, I gotta pin a message. I forgot, I can do that in this chat. Let's plug the Twitter. <laughs> I use it all the time with my TikTok comments? Yeah, I do. Look, call me cringe. <laughs> Shut up. You know, I gotta plug the Twitch. Because you cannot say, Oh, go follow my Twitch or go follow my IG. It, it hides the comment. That's why I have to say, Oh, I might be live on Twitch. Smile. Because if you explicitly say, Go check out my website. Go follow my social media. TikTok will literally hide the comment. Dude, st don't copy paste my tweet. <laughs> did I delete that tweet? I literally deleted that tweet. Wait, did I spell crumble wrong? Oh no, I did, didn't I? Wait, let me see. Did I spell crumble wrong? Dude, I'm cringe. Oh my god, I did spell crumble wrong. Oh my god. That's cringe. Oh my god, TikTok time. How's that? How's that? <laughs> no, because cause when I put the asterisk in, it didn't do the autocorrect. So that's my fault. Oopsie. Damn. Wait, did I misspell it in my Twitch title too? Wait, let me check that. Like phone streamer. No way, I, I misspelled it. Oh wait, I spelled it right in my Twitch title. It's just the goal I've tweet. Damn it. End me. Oh my god, is that my Twitch channel? Wait, you guys are on screen. <laughs> Anyway, back to work. No more time off task. Amazon will fire me. Edition. The act or process of adding. What? What's O W A H? Is that a zoomer phrase or is that a slur?
Additionally. Oh no, the camera's gone. Why is this? I'm gonna lose my mind. I'm gonna say bye, 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 but I know you think twice. How'd you get my first job? Okay, so my first job was at a daycare, and I had volunteered with them because I was a minor at the time during the school year, and during the summer they had a summer camp program. So since I was volunteering with them during the school year, I was like the first candidate for the summer program. It was alright job. Looking back, there could have been better management, but you know. 24 seconds and it's starting right now. Shot clock. Everything's plugged in. And then my second job was food service. Because that was fun and I got more hours than my um, daycare job. Did the kids think you were one of them? I mean, I was very- I was 16 when I started volunteering, so... But of course you saw me as a kid. Oh my god! First time chatter, hello! Welcome in! Can we get some yo's? If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me! Um, <laughs> I think your name is a fandom name, that's totally fine, but if you have a different nickname you wanna go by, just tell me! Hello! Been wasting my time with you, boy. Oh, that was bad. I love new jeans. <laughs> you got twenty four seconds and it's starting right now. Well, I got some sick pair of jeans the other day when I went thrifting. I posted them on Twitter. They're nice. Controversial? I hate jeans, but they do look nice. They're too tight sometimes. <laughs> Tina? Okay. Sounds good, Tina. <laughs> Sleeping in jeans, you're trolling. You are trolling. You are trolling. Whoa, is that my arm? Dude, I'm jacked. Wearing outside jeans a bit. No, please do not start this debacle again. Please. My mom used to make me wear skinny jeans. Why? That's so weird. My mom hated when I wore skinny jeans. She'd be like, you look so fucking fat. But I like skinny jeans because I like how I look. She would always have me choose like boot cut or like flare jeans. But the issue is since I'm like plus size and I'm a fat ass. Um, like whenever I would get like flare jeans, the the bottom, like, end of the jean would be as big as my thigh, so it, it, it did not look good. Flare jeans only look good if you, like, are taller and have slimmer legs. Skinny jeans are yucky. Well, I like them. Because if I wear baggy jeans, it just makes me look way too wide. But I do agree that, like, skinny jeans are, like, so five years ago. Or ten years ago. I hate when people wear leggings as pants. I do that all the time. It's because I really like form-fitting clothing if it's comfortable. Because I, I personally, I love the human form. I think everybody is beautiful. So it's like, I don't mind seeing leggings in public. I don't care. It's just when you can see their like undergarments through the leggings, that's when it's kind of awkward.
Also, can I ask if Tina, if you're still in chat, I saw you follow both my main channel and the art channel on the same day, which is crazy. Can I ask why? It's not often we have people follow both channels right away. Unless you're a real fan. Do yoga pants count as leggings? Kind of. Kind of. I mean, I'm wearing, I guess, kind of yoga pants, but they're, they're like, form-fitting. And they kind of cut off at my calf. They don't go all the way to my legs. Okay, just because you like it doesn't mean other people don't look great to them, okay? Oh, thank you for the light crystal. I don't like sweatpants that much. I think they're too baggy. I have one pair that I like that I got from the men's section about a year ago. Otherwise, I don't like sweatpants so much. Yeah, I don't like baggy clothes on me. Because, like, I feel like they just make me look bigger. I don't know. I, like, I'm confident in how I look. Oh my god, base cam one. <laughs> but it's just like, it doesn't look as good. Oh wait, are you, have you recently made an account too? Oh yeah, it says you made, you made an account the day you followed me. <laughs> That's so funny. That's great. Thank you for coming over to Twitch, man. Um, if you came from TikTok, TikTok content, wild, okay? But stream content, definitely more chill. You actually get to talk to people, you get to hang out. You're gonna enjoy your time here. Watch the main channel, though. It's a lot more fun. Oh, no! Oh, no! Also, when I was going through the clips and saw you guys are queer, I knew you'd be funny. Oh, no! Crystal, why'd you do that? Oh, my God. You were looking earlier? Oh, cringe. Uh, on me. Oh my god. <laughs> I hate my clippers sometimes. Oh my god. Yeah, my most popular- The most popular clip on my main channel is You Guys Are Queer. And it's so stupid. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, cause like, I'm peeking my mic a lot cause I'm laughing. Um, I heard my name look at chat. <laughs> Uh, cause like, usually, for my TikTok clips, I try to post more tame moments where I'm like, just talking about shit normally. I don't usually post, like, the really clippable moments. <laughs> oh my god. I can't. Uh, I can't. I can't. Back to work, everybody. No more time off task. I work for Amazon. Oh my god. Oh wait. Additive. Relating or characterized by addition. To throw into confusion to middle. This chat is so fun. That's good. I'm glad we're leaving a good impression. Everybody smile. Please smile for the new chatter. Yeah, there's some banger clips. And sometimes I will go back and watch them. Because you know they're fun moments from stream. Because I usually edit down most every Mario Kart and then Animal Crossing VOD. I'm currently on Mario Kart VODs from November. And Animal Crossing VODs from June. So... <laughs> oh yeah, hacker can't smile, everybody. <laughs> How long are you gonna keep that big going, hacker? I think a lot of people get hung up on like analytics or numbers, but I think as long as you make sure every stream is enjoyable for both yourself and your viewers, then every stream is good. Yes, guys, the title is real. It is not clickbait. You say to frown? I just frowned thinking the. thinking my face cam is on, but it's not. How long have I been streaming? I've been streaming since August of 2021. On this channel, I launched this channel in October of 22, but my main channel in 21. 
So I feel like I got the hang of things. ADDN, abbreviation for addition. I don't have be real because I don't like the idea of posting my pictures. Yeah, I know the ropes, but I have no clout. I have no, no, I have viewers. <laughs> but I haven't like popped off, popped off, and I think it's good because if you pop off too quickly, like a lot of other TikTok streamers do, they don't know what to do with their audience or their chat room, or their chat room is dead. Like I saw this one. I'm not gonna say their name because I. I physically don't remember their name, because I only chatted in one stream they had. But, um... They had made, like, 20 TikToks, and then... Um, what you call it? They had, like, 20 TikToks talking about streaming, but they had never streamed. And then they did, like, their... First ever stream, and they had, like, 20 viewers. And it's, like... If you start off with your first stream ever with 20 viewers, that's insane. That's not normal. And you don't know how to talk to your chat room. You don't know how to commentate. And it's... It's not a good show. I think it's best for somebody to have no viewers for a while. That way they can kind of formulate what they want to do. Yeah. I see people's B-reels on TikTok and I'm never gonna post it. But I'm like really curious about what they're posting. It's all a conspiracy to get you to use their app multiple times a day. It's kind of like daily logins that they have for, like, gacha games. Everything is a gacha game. So ADDNO, abbreviation for additional. This is my daily login, yeah. Everybody click on the stream. If you miss a stream, you get banned, just like Crystal did. Accessory added especially as an enhancement. Do not get add ons for food or restaurants. Actual scam. If someone got banned, yeah, mods find the clip. <laughs> I accidentally banned somebody. It was a misclick because I had my cursor on the screen and then I accidentally clicked. <laughs> no, if I ever had to seriously ban somebody, I would do it quietly. You guys would never know. You would just be like, oh, why did Mac stop typing for like a week? I'd be like, oh, yeah, I banned them. It was tragic. <laughs> Guys, I would never ban somebody on purpose. Who is Crystal? Yeah, everybody, follow the stream if you like what you see, if you think I'm funny. If you don't follow, then you hate me. <laughs> <laughs> Who is Sam? Did I say Sam? I don't know any Sams. Like, IRL either. Is this like a your mama bait? Or like a D's Nuts bait? No, stop it! This is- I hate this bit. I hate this bit. No, stop this bit. Your mom's jokes still make me laugh. Oh, you're gonna love this chat, man. The, the one bit that me and chat always go back on is your mom jokes. And we, just, we need to find a different bit, but they're so good. I used to hate them, but now I kind of like them. But then it kind of leans into the, you know, I'm gay bit. Which is not a bit. I am... <laughs> I am queer. <laughs> but... You know, what needs to happen is one day one of us makes it your mom jokes and then someone's mom has to like die. Or no, I mean like, they're just be like, my mom is dead. And then it's awkward. And then we never make the joke again. 
Did you hear the joke about the gas later? No. Is that a bait? No, what I'm s no! You guys know what I'm talking about, you know what I mean. No, you guys know what I mean. <laughs> guys, do I need to play the disabled card? Do I need to blame my brain fog and my big brain? Make phone streamer. Now I wish my mom was dead so I could say that. Mods, what? Keep an eye on it. Lemon. You won't, You don't chat in the stream for like three months and you say this shit? Where's the big brain emote? Uh... It's coming. It's in the works. Uh, I'm working on my website, okay? I'm talking about the website. Um, Peep the pin message, everybody. Follow my Twitter. Art website launching in April. I need to wait for my business license to get approved. Yeah, I look a lot like my mom and I hate it. Like, our faces are very similar and I hate it. Anyway. Okay guys, I'm gonna mute real quick. I'm gonna mute. Sorry, my sister needs to come in the room. I'm muted. I'm Okay, we're in the clear. Nobody say the p-word. Nobody say the p-word. You will get... banned. <laughs> Do you ever mute phone calls to fart? <laughs> no. If your mic is that good to make up a fart, then... Maybe get a worse mic. <laughs> yes. Fart is a banned word. You should know that. <laughs> Dude, what if I did a no cam, no mic stream? Like, I just had no mic and it was just the PNG tuber. If I'm comfortable with them, they can come in the bathroom with me. What? Do you mean like your GF? Ew. Okay. Okay. I think it's fine to like fart in front of your partner after a while. Funny story, I accidentally did it because <laughs> we were like walking through the park, and I was laughing because they made me laugh, and then I farted, and it was really funny. But I still <laughs> tried to not fart in front of them. But I feel like you should not use the bathroom in front of your partner. I feel like this is a bit much. Because I feel like when you're using the restroom, you're very vulnerable. So it's like, I feel like this is a bit much. I mean, what do I have to hide? <laughs> what? That's so weird. I would not want to see my partner piss or shit. It's like, yes, I've seen probably every part of them, but I don't want to see that. Ew, what the fuck, Mac? Ew. Sometimes when I laugh too hard, it's- Sometimes when I laugh, it's too hard. It's hard for me to breathe. Mood. But that's because of my big brain. Wait, you mean like on a f Oh, when you're on the phone in the bathroom. Oh, if that happens, I just say, hey, I gotta go. 
I'd be like, oh wait, hold on, my, my sister's calling me. I gotta hang up the phone, my guy. <laughs> what do? <laughs> Why would you be on a FaceTime in the bathroom? That's so trashy. Guys, address to direct the attention of oneself. Or like a postage address. I'm needy, bro. If some if my partner's like, hey, can I call you? I'm on the shooter, I'm like, no. Text me, do not call me. <laughs> Guys, what is wrong with y'all? Y'all are too clingy. Ew. A lot. Addressee. One to whom something is addressed to. Twenty-four-seven FaceTime? Okay, if your bitch is like, we need to be on the phone all day, we need to be texting all day, even if you're at work, even if you're at school, too clingy, red flag, okay? Red flag. No one should be demanding your attention literally all day and all night, okay? That is not good. You need to have some degree of separation. You, your partner is not somebody who is on standby to your every need, every calling, okay? It's cute, but if they demand it, that's not good. It was a challenge. Guys, we're gonna do the 24-hour FaceTime challenge, and if I fail, I delete my channel. Hashtag real, hashtag clickbait. Deuce. To offer his argument, reason, or proof. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Oh, I thought you said smile. <laughs> I'm joking, smile. Based on another streamer, 24 hour challenge. Who would want to talk to me for 24 hours? Would you, would one of you guys do it? I like your nails, thank you. I did these on St. Patrick's Day. Just simple. You can't tell on camera, but they're like holographic. Hashtag not sponsored, but I, I like hollow taco. Oh yeah, but during pandemic, I didn't really talk to anybody during pandemic. I kind of just kept to myself. I and mean, I would text my one friend, but otherwise I didn't talk to many people. That's why I streamed because I was lonely. Smile, Hollow Taco. Yeah, I love their shit. I wanted to get their neutral drop, like they had all the tans and browns, but wasn't in the budget. Meggy Sports could not afford it. Yeah, I think the longest I've stayed up for was like 18 hours. Yes, guys, the title is real. It is not clickbait. If you think that's funny, follow the channel. <laughs> yeah, I think the least amount of sleep I got was like three hours, but that's because like I fell asleep, woke up, fell asleep, woke up. Adenine. A purine base that codes genetic information in the molecular chain of DNA or RNA. I once pulled an all nighter watching an anime. Oh my god, when I first watched Squid Game. I. But well, that's another set of pages done, everybody. Wow. An hour 30 in. Oh my god. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. No way. Okay, since we've been chatting so much, everybody, these two pages took literally 50 minutes. We have fun here. Yeah, so when I watched Squid Game, because I waited like a month after it came out, because I like to wait for the heart to die down to see if something is actually good, right? So I watched it all in like two sittings. I stayed up to 2 a.m. one night, and then I stayed up 
So I stay I stayed up till like 2 a.m. for two nights in a row. That's why I don't binge shows. I messed up the count. When is Squid Game IRL coming out? Didn't Mr. Beast do that? You still haven't watched Squid Game? I mean, it's 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 um it is rated mature. It is kind of gory. So if you don't like gore, then. Oh, this is where I messed up the dots. I messed up my guide dots. I have tried Mr. B's burger. It's okay. It's alright. It, the patties are way too thin. Because when I think of a patty, I think of like a thick patty. But since they're smash burgers, they're like that thin. <laughs> Ghost kitchens. Oh my god. Bye, Tina. Thank you for hanging out. Can we get some... Yeah. <laughs> Bye, Tina. <laughs> hope you enjoyed your stay. We hope to see you again, man. Had fun chatting with you. I'm a yo is by okay. Adenoid. An enlarged mass of tissue near the opening of the nose into the throat. We made such a good first impression, hopefully. <laughs> okay, you know what I think is really cringe? <laughs> never mind. <laughs> I'm never gonna leak. Why are we peace to yoing? I don't know. You know, chatter says something and then everybody else copies. That's how chat works. You see, if I type, if I say smile, then everybody's gonna type smile. Leak? Nah. <laughs> okay, my take was, I think it's funny when you see Twitch help tips from somebody who is a recent partner. Or somebody who averages less than, like, 200 viewers. Because they're like, let me tell you how to become a streamer. Let me give you all the tips that is really basic shit. And look at me, I average 100 viewers. Like, there's a few creators who can fall under that umbrella, but I just... Eh, I don't get it. It's like, why would I take advice from somebody who... <laughs> don't! Guys, this is my old channel. You can't... Wait, you can't clip. I should have disabled clips on this channel. <laughs> No, but it's like, don't you get what I'm saying? It's like, obviously I probably wouldn't take tips from Ninja, you know, who had years of experience. But I wouldn't take tips from somebody who is a nobody, quote-unquote, in the bigger streaming scene, you know what I mean? You're not any better than me? Kinda. It's kinda like that. It's like... Uh... And, and, like, I talk about Twitch shit all the time, but I don't market myself as a Twitch help person. And I see so many accounts on TikTok that go in that direction, who have, like, tens of thousands of followers on TikTok, but on their actual Twitch, they don't... Their numbers aren't reflective of that. I take tips from you? Don't. Do you see me? Do you see me with a thousand viewers? No. So, obviously, what I'm doing is not working to grow. Any tip? Hey, yo. But it, it's just, like... Cause like, I'll see the accounts on TikTok, I'm like, oh my god, this guy has like 100,000 followers, let me see their Twitch, and they have like... <laughs> There's one guy. They had like, 2,000 followers, partnered streamer. And it's like... Why are you marketing yourself as a Twitch pro? And... <laughs> you know what I mean? It's just like... I don't get it. I mean, since you have raids off that- No, I do not have raids turned off. I have, um... 
Um, I have raids disabled for non-affiliated channels to avoid hate raids. Because if somebody's an affiliate, they have to be vetted by Twitch to make sure they're a legit channel, usually. And I have um, raids turned off for one viewer. Because if it's one viewer raiding you, then it's literally just the streamer. And if I allow one viewer raids, somebody who had like a bad username could be shown on screen. So those are the only two types of raids I disable. Otherwise, people don't raid me because I don't collab a lot. I'm not usually... Um... I'm not at the bottom of any, like, discovered tab because I'm not at zero viewers. But I'm also not at the top because I usually average, like, 8 to 10, right? I feel like you're not a pro that can give tips until you can live off your stream. I agree with that. I agree with that. And I feel like a lot of people fall into the pit hall or the pit hole of help content. Like, you know the master class courses where it's like directors and actors and sculptors and artists giving these crash courses to the general public when they won't have the access to resources or the money to actually pursue that passion. It just seems exploitative to an extent. And especially with stream content, since so many, so many people want to become streamers, myself included, it just seems very icky. I don't like stream tip content. I don't like it. I made a tweet a few weeks ago um, where I was like, if I ever exclusively start posting Twitch tip content, cancel me. Literally, do it. Um, I still talk about streaming and shit. I still talk about what I think works and what doesn't work. Because um, my main thing is I like to focus on genuine and actual substance and content of your stream. Just make sure, the thing I always say is make sure every stream is enjoyable for both you and your chat. Because if they aren't having fun, you aren't having fun, then what's the point? Then you're just doing it for money or clout, and that's stupid. Um, because those two things will fade away. Your community is more important than anything. Um, but yeah, I will never market myself as a creator, helper, content. I'd rather just like focus on actual entertaining shit. And it might seem like I'm throwing shade at certain individuals. I know a very prominent figure on TikTok is Catalante. She can do her own shit. But it's just like, it's very hard to not... It's also like, if you start branding yourself as a Twitch help person, or like a news person, once you make your content too niche, it's very hard to break out of that niche. That's why my main focus is not collab. My main focus is gaming and commentary. Because gaming and commentary will always be like the two main pillars of what my stream will be for the current time being. Yeah, anyway. Uh, TLDR, if you make Twitch tip content, be very careful with it. Don't make it your main thing, because it's gonna be very hard to change and adjust your branding. Once you want to change, or once you want to pursue something else. <gasps> My tech manager always told me, if you teach a subject, it's because you're not gonna have to do it. That's what we would see about all the teachers, like, you know, the fat gym teachers would be like, uh -huh, you will- Oh my goodness. Hello, I'm back. Okay. I don't... Wait, it cut off at Fat Gym Teachers? Lamo. Okay, so the joke was... Um... <laughs> no, don't clip it, don't clip it. Mods, disable clips. I should seriously disable clips on this channel. Um... I don't... This is the good capture card. I don't know why the... Wait, is that actually the bad capture card? Anyway, the joke was we would make fun of all the fat gym teachers because you'd be like, oh haha, ha, you're teaching gym because you can't actually be a professional athlete. Well, wow. I think my capture card is just overheating. Because it's usually not warm, but it's like hot. That's weird. 
Hi, Lemon. Um, chatters, if you can hear me and see me, type 21. <laughs> 21. Thank you, Mag. <laughs> Okay, Chatters, what should I do for my birthday stream? You guys had three hours to think about it. What should I do? Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. What if we did you laugh, you lose, but instead of like doing it on my computer because I don't want to fuck up my computer, I do it like just watching videos on my phone, like in my bed or on the couch, and I have like water in my mouth. <laughs> do you think that'd be funny? Every child who donates gets to choose a decoration for the cake. I have a different bit for donations planned, so don't worry. I have a different bit. I forgot about you, Laffy Lose. I know it. We haven't done it in a long time. Because since I'll be streaming until 11 p.m., I kind of wanted to end the night doing like a watch along, but I don't know what I would watch along with. Because I kind of wanted to do like either TikTok time and just capture my phone screen, or do like a like a watch along movie or something. But I have to find like a DMCA free movie. There is like a Kirby animated series that's posted by Nintendo that we can watch. Because it's kind of like chill story time and I think that's cute. A nice way to end the night. That'd be funny. Okay. We'll see if I can do that. Bye. My birthday's on a Monday. Smile. Hello. Yes, everybody, the title is real. It is not clickbait. I don't think this word will fit. This is the first word that won't fit, everybody. Which Monday, April 24th? Me and my friends or my roommates are going to celebrate probably the weekend after my birthday. That way we all can go hang out. Because might go to, like, a restaurant. Is super fragilist to get, like... I can't say it. I don't know. It could be. I mean, it's going to take a long time before I get to S, honestly. And this is... Adeneso... Adenosine triphosphate, which is ATP. I don't know what that is. Adenovirus. A family of viruses causing infections of the respiratory tract. Oh my god, COVID? I think it's a science thing? Yeah, I think so too, man. Sounds like so photosynthesis. But I can't talk. I have a lisp. Adept. Expert or highly skilled? 
XQC Despair. Did you guys have to do science fairs? I had to do it in just like elementary, so like fifth and sixth grade. I didn't have to do any in middle school, they were optional. But um, for any kids that did do science fair in like middle school, I think they got to present them at our um, city fair, so that was kind of cool. And they offered scholarships. Like thousand dollar scholarships if you placed. to or sufficient for a specific requirement. Yeah, I think the science fairs were dumb. It didn't really encourage you to, like, explore. And, like, actually learn. And, like, honestly, I feel like the science fair favored the richer kids, because, you know, they could buy whatever supplies they needed, whatever materials. Like, what did I do? I think one year I did, like, a, a salt thing, where I took our salt crystals. Because that was like the cheapest thing we could do. One year I did like seeds and plants to see which fertilizer worked best or how certain plants performed in sunlight. Give support or maintain loyalty to stick fast. You should get balloons. I probably will. Should I get like you know the the gold numbers? And then post like a really cute picture. Ig the cliche ones. Oh, 24. And then be like, everybody's having kids and graduating, but you know what? I'm still in college and it's been six years. I have no kids. I'm a depo. And I'm single. Oh. <laughs> What if I get a girlfriend for my birthday? Oh my god. Somebody write that down. I want to become an IG girly, but I don't have anybody who can take pictures. Because my friends are ass at taking pictures. Should I get a private photographer? I will pay you with exposure. <laughs> oh my god, an IG girly. Hi, Titans! Oh my god, you gifted five subs, you unlocked this stream! Oh my god, I almost dropped the pen. Adhesion. The union of bodily tissues. What? <laughs> huh? I want my crush to love me back for your birthday. How would? How is that a present for me? I got a birthday. I got a girlfriend for my birthday. Ain't no way. Not clickbait. <laughs> uh, I think that's a good contender, but maybe take out some of those question marks. He's taking up valuable character space. My title. <laughs> I'll write back. <laughs> I'm gonna get some water. <laughs> Give me like 10 seconds. Guys, what if I did a girlfriend reveal for my birthday? Wait, what if I hired somebody to be my girlfriend? Like, you know, like uh, the, the Giga Chads will hire girls to like be in pictures. What if I hired a girlfriend? <laughs> How much would that cost? Is that in the budget? Somebody do the numbers. I should play a dating sim for my birthday though? I would just get sad because I don't have anybody to celebrate with. It would just be me, my computer, and chat. Imagine nobody watches. Like how you hired fake roommates for the pancake stream? No, I did not. That is not in the budget to hire actors. That is something 
that <laughs> you can get a cardboard cutout of Aurora. Dude, if I was gonna get a cardboard cutout, I'd get one of Jensen Ackles. My actual crush. Um. Um, I'm gonna mute. I'm gonna mute. The coast is clear, everybody. Sister is gone. She said you guys smell. Dawson Zendaya, she's very pretty. Has your sister heard who your crush is? I think she's aware. Because Jensen Ackles was my phone screensaver in like junior high, so she probably saw it. Adhesive. Tending to adhere. Sticky. I think it's funny that you guys type Lamau in the chat room. It's so funny to me. I love chat rooms where people just react. Like, when people type Lamau or lol w along with like normally chatting, I think it's the best chat room. <laughs> Because if you have the type of chat room where they react with like Lamau's, KWs, or just emotes, then it makes the chat room move faster. It's good. Surprising. I haven't made a mistake yet today. Adhesive tape. Don't jinx it. I'm saying that to farm a clip, okay? I'm farming. I'm actually throwing. But how am I gonna mess up tape? A tape coated on one side with an adhesive mixture. Okay, so for context on how far I got today, um, where's Aquaman? Aquaman is here, and I just finished adhesive tape, so I've done a page and a half, everybody. Claps and chat. the don't subscribe meta, please? For the case at hand apart from other applications. Copy pasta meta please, it's been a while. I know. Can I bring this the spin to distract? That actually is a good meta for this channel. Dude, Lemon, where'd you have that? <laughs> I was gonna say, okay, chatters, chatters. Since peace and art when the website launches, I will be giving away a free painting. And then two $50 gift cards to three lucky viewers, okay? What everybody needs to do is give me your Prime sub on the main channel, okay? I, I need Primes this month and next month and every month from now on. Because <laughs> I want to do a giveaway every few months for the art channel. Um, when I do do the website launching stream, it will be hosted on my main channel. 
because I have more platform, more audience, more regular viewers on that channel. So everybody, I need your prime subs, okay? I don't want gifted. Gifted are great, but just give me your primes. She said doo doo. Are you making fun of my stutter? Batty is now my third favorite shatter. <laughs> You're being ableist. I'm disabled. Does that say ad? Yeah, an ad break. I love how I'm not even top five. She hates me. Well, I did ban you, so I think that's a good indicator as why you're not top five. <laughs> Peace in 17 currently really mad. Nah, I'm not mad. See, I'm not shaking. <laughs> Adiabatic. Occurring without loss or gain of heat. Yes, everybody, the title is real. It is not clickbait. I'm writing every word in the dictionary. <laughs> Why are you replying to stream elements? <laughs> Dude, stream elements is a literal robot. They're not gonna reply back, Lemon. I can't. I've missed Lemon. Lemon Lemon is my favorite chatter. No joke. Why why are you doing exclamation commands and shit? Are you trying to see if there's anything bad? I mean, I have basically all the same commands here as the main channel. Okay, you know how some small streamers will enable like I'm plotting? Okay. Rut row. I'm like a W. Um. <laughs> yeah, I don't have a secret here because I, I would forget to update it. Yeah, um, PG 13 chant. I was gonna say. Okay, you know, some small streamers will have like channel points where it's like fight or gamble or all that jazz. It's cringe as fuck. You know what's funny? You think you guys are being funny by spamming the chat, right? But it literally doesn't show up on screen. I can disable bot messages here. So, VOD watchers, you're fine. Smile. <laughs> Sched this, this channel does not have a schedule. <laughs> um, since I don't have a schedule, make sure your notifications turned on. What is vulgar as command? Oh, that's a mod command, you dummy! <laughs> hate how in the commands list it shows mod commands. Those are supposed to be hidden. No, I've never had a slay. Oh, yeah! Like slay, like. Blah. Adieu. To bid farewell. <laughs> VOD watchers are silly. No, we need the VOD watchers. That's where I get ads, okay? Oh yeah, the commands that are copy pasta. Haha, <laughs> I don't have any of those. You just gotta Google. As long as I don't see any Among Us genitalia, I don't care. I, I, never mind, I should delete copy pasta. <laughs> All of it. What? What? What, you want me to say the P word? Where have you seen that? In chats? No, no. Guys, I would I would never actively seek that out. 
okay? It, I would just see it in chats. Don't kek out. <laughs> That's wild. Dude, if you watch big streamers all the time, there's little shitheads that come in and do genitalia copypastas. And they get insta-banned. It happens. We just don't see it here, because everybody's good. Smile. Everybody smile. Oh, why would you say that? Now they know. Oh. True, you're right, Lemon. The worst is when they do a scary face during her game? Ah, uh, I don't care. It's just like, you know the copy bosses where they try to make a picture? It only looks good if you're watching, like, on actual Twitch with the... With a default text size, because when there's like a larger text size, or if you're watching a mobile, sometimes the copy buses don't work and it looks dumb. That's why I don't like copy buses. Not that they're bad, it's just like it's annoying. And I hate when people are annoying. I feel like I could use PC to stop a lot of big chats. Do it, and then people will click on the emote and be like, "Oh, that's a who make a little affiliate." Cringe. I mean, they would never call you out as a chatter, but they would just see me as cringe. They're like, "Oh, PC and seventeen less than seven hundred followers." Cringe. You open. <laughs> also, I would like to say for the art giveaways, it will be with channel points. So make sure you guys are farming and saving channel points, okay? so humiliating dude you looked at my commands list and you saw that I don't have those commands oh did I not update my cheer command I'm not in that beta anymore <laughs> I wish my channel had direct cheering there's no channel yeah this <laughs> that's why I'm doing the giveaway on the main channel because how the giveaway is gonna work is I'm gonna make it cost Probably like maybe a thousand to five thousand points, depending on the giveaway, because it's a lot easier to keep track. Because if if it, if any random can join, then I don't want. I'd rather have a regular viewer, rather chat or lurker, win the prize than somebody who just followed that day. I think that's cringe. Holy. I mean, some of y'all have like a hundred thousand points. That's I have like 24k no i <laughs> the most i would charge is 5k points i'm still thinking about the um uh, what you call it how much i want to change i think i want to do because when people follow they get 250 points right i think for a free painting i'll make it 5,000 points and then for the gift card i'll make it 1,000 points I think that's fair. <laughs> Let anyone join for clout? Yeah, my non-existent clout with my 10 viewers. <laughs> but I'm thinking of the way you are. Said I'm fine. Said I moved on. Uh, I'm trying to learn... What song is it called? Um, Glimpse of Us by Joji. I'm trying to learn it. A glimpse of us. When I first heard that song, I cried. Not because I could relate. <laughs> but it's just a really sad song. <laughs> Hashtag giveaway in the chat room, everybody. The join. I didn't fit to an email. <laughs> Without end or limit.
ad interim. Without end or limit. <laughs> yeah, exclamation giveaway in chat, everybody. Hashtag not an ad. Wait, do you think if for the, um, <laughs> for the launch website stream, I put hashtag ad in the title? <laughs> do you think that's a good bit? Because the only reason why people put, like, hashtag ad in the title is that way people know it's a sponsored stream, but it's like, Peace and Art is my company. <laughs> so, <laughs> is, it, is it a good bit if I put hashtag ad, hashtag sponsored? <laughs> But then people would click on the stream and be like, oh my god, Megan actually got a sponsor. I mean, Peason actually got a sponsor. And then they're like, oh, it's just her plugging her cringe-ass paintings. <laughs> I think that's a good bit. Is giveaway a tag? No, if I tag giveaway, they're gonna have randos. Wait, chatters, use your brains. If less people join the giveaway, then your chances of winning increases. So not saying you should not encourage people to watch the stream. No, no. Um, only have chatters join. Adios! Say goodbye. Or, ad interim for the intervening time. I thought the goal was to reach more people. That is true, but there was one Mario Kart tournament stream I did, and I tagged tournament. And we had, like, three randos come in and sweep. I think Tanuki was one of those three, but then Tanuki became a regular viewer. So... Tags are good, but then you also have to think about the people coming in through tags. Like, imagine somebody wins a $50 gift card and then they don't use it. Then I... It's not that I lose $50 with that gift card. It's just a potential of a $100 profit that could have gone to somebody who would have actually bought something. Because the whole point of giving away a... <laughs> or we could cancel piece and so fewer people join. No, no. Please don't. Um. Okay, because the whole point of, we talked about this last time, but the whole point of giving away gift cards is that way, if the regular item costs 150 to 200 if somebody has a $50 gift card, that's a 25% discount. So they're more likely to actually buy a product and possibly buy more in the future. So that's why companies offering gift cards, coupon codes, discounts, free shipping is beneficial. Because even if they use the coupon, they're still gaining a profit because there actually is a purchase being made. So giving away a gift card is only beneficial to my brand and company if it goes to somebody who's actually going to fucking buy something. Or save up to buy it in the future. Another interesting point is, you know how when you see, like, um, Uber Eats or DoorDash offering, like, free $25 credit with your first order, the reason why they don't offer coupons for regulars is because you know they're gonna keep using the service because the service is good enough to stand on its own. And the reason why they offer a substantial discount to new customers is to get them hooked. It's annoying as a regular consumer of the service, but the whole point of those promos is to get no more unique customers. When in comparison, my strategy for the first few months with the art website is to get just sales. Or at least website clicks. Okay, adipose. Of or relating to animal fat. Fatty. <gasps> Mods ban that word. Okay, final page, everybody, final page. Because with any type of advertising campaign, you have to think about what your goals are in terms of audience reach. So you need to think of, do I want to prioritize unique viewers? Do I want to prioritize sales? Do I want to prioritize returning subscriptions? Will you be able to add runs? 
Dude, imagine having like a sponsored TikTok. I've thought about that, because you can pay like 20 bucks to run your ads to like 200 people, right? You can like make a TikTok or make an Instagram reel and it'll just push the video out to people. But I don't know if that's good, because if I see a regular looking ass TikTok and then it says sponsored in the bottom left, I'll make, oh, that's dumb, and then I swipe away. It just feels fake. Yeah, guys, the title is real. It is not clickbait. I am writing the whole dictionary. Because I think the best way for the art content to grow is making good standalone content, like the monologue videos with the speed paintings, and expanding on that. Maybe doing vlog content to some extent. But making content that is shareable, that way more I see it. Because I feel like the monologue type stuff is heart-wrenching enough to where people can relate to it, and then hopefully they'll share it with their friends. And then it just expands from there. Not saying that I'm begging people to share. It's just that's how a brand can grow. Because sharing videos on like TikTok or IG or whatever, it's, excuse me, it's essentially like word of mouth. ADJ, abbreviation for adjective. You know, Crystal, one day that message is gonna annoy the shit out of me. I'm actually gonna ban you. Not accidentally. Slash J slash SRS. Wait, my. Wait, my VTuber mouth isn't moving. Omega Dance. <laughs> Why did nobody say anything? Are you guys all audio listeners? Or are you just like so honed in on the calligraphy? Adjacent. Situated near or next? I'm tapping out a letter. What? To your crush? The art is too good to look away? Thank you. A word that typically serves as a modifier of a noun to describe. Okay, I'm gonna speed run this page, okay? I join. To suspend indefinitely or until a stated time. Now stream elements ignoring you. You know, stream elements is a lurker. They talk when they want to talk. Calling out lurkers is cringe and bad. Haven't we learned that already? Isn't that like Twitch tip number one? Don't call it lurkers. Okay, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna take a snack break. I had my sandwich. It's time for dessert. For dessert, I'm eating the leftover cookies from earlier. Um, I had tried crumble on stream on the main channel. We had lemon drop with poppy seeds. Um, this is strawberry cheesecake, actually the best. And then um, sea salt toffee. These are just the leftover cookies that I didn't finish. Because I cut each cookie into fours. And then I didn't eat the whole fourth, so. Thank you for the lure crystal. I think it's kind of psychotic that you're trying to talk to a robot. Not gonna lie. You know, I think it's kind of... Weird enough that you're trying to talk in a Twitch chat, expecting the streamer to answer. 
But you're trying to expect the robot to answer you? <laughs> yeah, I know you're trolling. <laughs> I'm lonely too, aren't we all? Oh my god. Wait, let me see if I can find the video. I saw a TikTok that perfectly like explained what I'm feeling. Despair. What are for all just robots? Then who's paying to type in the chat? They must be rich. If you're if you're doing that, just give me subs, easy. Oh no! Oh wait, this is it. You know, classic text over video. Whenever I see these videos, I just pause. This person, their user is Plucky Bunny. Because, like, my save video is art and then relatable content, okay? Cringe. But the text says, When you protected your piece a little too well and now you have two friends, one of them is your sister, your boyfriend, and a growing obsession with things you liked when you were a kid. Too real. But the thing is, um, I only have one friend. And I have no boyfriend or girlfriend. <laughs> so it's like... Like, there's people, like, I talk to, but it's, like, it's very hard to find people who you can be, like, fully comfortable with, you know what I mean? Because, like, um, chatters know. I was diagnosed with depression and anxiety last year, right? And I knew for a long time, but it's, like, it's very hard for me to, like, maintain composure and, like, quote-unquote, be okay when I'm hanging out with people sometimes. Like, when I went to my friend's house, my friend knows that I'm, like, struggling. Um, and I was playing with their cats, and I was just playing with the cats, and I was like, then I got sad, because <laughs> I was like, I wish I had cats, I wish I had something to, like, keep me company, and I started crying, and I felt bad, but then they comforted me, and I was fine, but it's like, I can't imagine, like, bringing a new friend into my life, and, like, having them, like, have to deal with that shit, you know what I mean? Because, like, you can't expect a partner or a friend to, like, be able to handle your shit. Like, you can't demand that from somebody because everybody has their own boundaries and shit. So, thank you, Kim. Um, but it's just, like... Because, like, people have pushed me away for, like, being too sad. <laughs> uh, one of my friends, years ago, this was, like, right out of high school. They were like, you know, I don't want to talk to you if you're going to keep being, like, sad all the time. And it's like, okay... And then I just stopped being sad around them, but then it felt, like, weird. Like, it's exhausting, like, pretending to be okay, you know what I mean? And I would like to clarify, I'm not Twitch deaf. <laughs> Twitch deaf. I, I'm okay. I'm getting medical treatment. I'm fine. Uh, I'm not in any, um, headspace to hurt myself or anybody else, so I'm fine. Um, it's just, like, internal shit. I'm not parasocial, but I care for you, dude. <laughs> Alarm bells. Um, you guys are so cute. I, I know you guys care, and I care for you guys, too. Like, collectively, you know what I mean? Um, but it, it's just hard to, like, trust people. And it's something that I'm learning how to do. Because, like, my, my, my one friend was talking to me. And they're like, you know, don't be scared to make friends. But then it's like... And I was telling them everything. And it's just like, how can I expect somebody new to be able to, like, be able to handle everything? Because, like, not saying that I'll be sad right from the start, because obviously, like, you don't want to scare people away. Um. But I feel like there's a point in every friendship where, like, you're kind of... It's not like a relationship where there's, like, a honeymoon phase where, like, you're hanging out, you're goofing and gaffing. And then there's a point where you kind of, like, get more, like closer and you start sharing shit and then there's the point after to where you have to identify if this friend is good and healthy for you and if you can be a good support to that friend because not everybody has the tools in their toolkit to be able to support somebody who's struggling right and 
it's a very difficult decision to one trust people and then also to like offer support to people who need it because I know for me it's very hard because I know I'm struggling with things and I don't know if I can be as good of a support as I could be to a friend and it's like I don't I don't want to like make a new friend and not be able to like help them because like I'm the type of person to where like if I have somebody I care about I will like full send okay I will do anything I will literally do anything um, and I'm not saying that you should expect that from other people because that's not good but it's just like I I just can't handle anybody new whether romantic or platonic I, I can't anyway these cookies are pretty good You're very caring, thank you. I try. I think it's also because like I take things way too seriously. <laughs> Dude, that strawberry shortcake cookie is so good. Or strawberry cheesecake, it's literally so good. Get back to work. <laughs> No more time off to ask. I work for Amazon. Yeah, anyway, thank you guys for listening. It's, it's hard to not think about shit because it's always on my mind. But genuinely streaming and like being able to chat with everybody and like have a space to where like I can goof and gaff and then like you guys can goof and gaff. It's a very nice positive thing in my life right now and I want it to stay that way. So thank you guys. It looks like watermelon. Yeah, that's what chatters were saying earlier. <clears throat> I must use the wrong pen. Yeah, I hope you're doing okay. You know, it'll be a tough journey, Mac, but I'm sure you can do it, okay? What is the song? Your mom good one. Um, this is Beware the Forest Fungus, Kirby and the Rainbow something. Um, Kirby and the Rainbow Curse. <laughs> Why is your mom coughing in your face? Put a mask on. Adjoining. To be situated next to, or a point of line. Hmm. That's weird. Okay, you know, ever since I've been, like, getting, like, tests and screenings for my big brain shit, I'm, like, super paranoid about everything. Because, like, for the symptoms I'm experiencing, they're, like, obscure and should not be happening. I did say on the main channel when I talked about it that I would not talk about it, but essentially, um, I don't have cancer. Pog you. Yes, the title is real. It is not clickbait. <laughs> I don't have cancer, but what can happen with my big brain, since my brain is bigger than my skull, some of like the brain juices can leak throughout my body. And because of that, this is like a... So, the, the big brain condition is, like, very common, okay? But the brain leaking thing is, like, a 5% chance of it happening, okay? So, essentially, when some of the fluid leaks in your body, it usually falls down your spine, so it can collect between, like, your spinal discs or, like, in your spinal cord. Um, so, they found some of that. And there's, like, a little... 
smaller than that actually it's like very little it's like that big in my spine of just like a a pouch of fluid it's a cyst which you hear cyst and be like cancer but it's not cancerous cancerous is only when it starts like attacking your body right and if i had cancer it would have come up in like my my blood test which nothing came up so yay no cancer but the problem is i have another scan later this week uh, ch chatters, don't tell the main channel. <laughs> this is art channel lore. So. But since I experienced paralysis in my whole body, not just my arms, I have to get more scans done. So. Basically, what they told me is that if I'm experiencing more symptoms in my leg, then I probably have, like, a larger cyst in my lower spine so we'll see in the upcoming weeks but it's like i don't know it sucks i'm i'm, I'm fine i like i'm why did, why did i talk about this <laughs> oh because i was talking about like them being your parents being sick all the time anyway anyway i know it's very easy to like look over little medical things but Definitely, when you have your, like, animal checkups, break up every little thing to your doctor. That way there's, like, at least a written record of what the fuck is going on. Because if you go into your doctor's visit and be like, Oh yeah, this has been going on for two years, and they're like, why didn't you tell me? And it's like... There's so much, like, anxiety with sharing things with your doctor, but don't be scared to share, okay, guys? I hope everything turns out well. Yeah, me too, man. <laughs> why are you assuming the stream elements is a girl? Hi, Jib. Can we get some pizza to use? First time chatter? For new follower, too. Hey, you can pray for me. You can peace I do pray, I guess. <laughs> but I appreciate it. It's... I don't know. It's, it's, it's some shit. It is doubly frustrating because... I've been suffering for like a year and a half, right? And... So much could have been like figured out sooner. It, I love American healthcare. Tab 1, if you agree. Wait, if Mac asks out stream elements, you'll give Mac five dollars? What? <laughs> Dude, I love seeing all the twos in chat. Yeah, Keelan, of course, the EU viewer. Not understanding. <laughs> yeah, anyway, my point is, don't be scared to go to the doctor. Don't be scared to go to urgent care. If you can't get a visit with your PCP right away, go to urgent care. That way there's at least like a medical record of what your symptoms are. So, yeah. I think Baddie's from UK, too. I love it, I love it, I love the way you make me feel. That's so pretty. Sorry. The Way by Ariana Grande featuring Mac Miller. <laughs> See, we caught, we, we got Baddie out of Lurk. Okay, just says just because Crystal says they love the U British viewers, I'm not saying I do. It's because the UK people can't sub with Prime. That's why I hate them. I'm just kidding. Just kidding. Uh, back to work. Okay, my goal is to get this done by three hours at a time. No more distractions and no more trauma dumping. Tell me, don't trauma dump. If you see me getting sad, you say Megan or you say Pisa and stop. Adjourn. To suspend indefinitely. Oh, I didn't change the command. Thank you. Remind me later. Actually, I can update. Uh, can I update it now? <laughs> Exclamation point your mom. <laughs> Adjourn. To suspend indefinitely or until a stated time. 
Generation Ds? Dude, I think that's the most degen message hacker has ever sent. And of course, in the art channel. A judge. To hold or pronounce to be. It's the edgiest I'll ever get. Stay that way, hacker. Please stay wholesome. Please, please. <laughs> please. We need one good chatter here. I think the blue is the best gradient of all the pages. Okay, Rainbow goes crazy, though. I wonder if Tina will be so wholesome. They seem pretty good. I feel like a lot of the younger viewers, they're a toss-up. Like, I think... No joke, I think Crystal is the craziest chatter. <laughs> like, Crystal's a toss-up. <laughs> like, 99% uh, like of the messages are unhinged and, like, 1% wholesome. The art channel is somehow more calm and chaotic than the main. True. I mean, they were only here for like 30 minutes, yeah, you know. I mean, keeping a new viewer for that long is pretty substantial. Usually people just say hi and then leave. First time chatters and never come back, but if, if, if people stay for 30 minutes to an hour, that's really good. That means I, along the chat room, was able to hold their attention. Very good. Imagine they're watching the stream right now. <laughs> that's sometimes what I'll do, like if I'm chatting and I say bye-bye, I usually stay for like five minutes to see if they talk shit. Remember that stream where we got in trouble for saying the P word? Don't do it. Don't try me. I literally will ban. Peace and did a good job. Thank you. I mean, I was doing my stay the host. Yeah, Keelan's first stream was the I'm back and my brain is too big stream. That was literally Keelan's first stream. Nice try, hacker. I got the fastest fingers. Imagine I ban Acker. Educate. To settle judicis do judicially. Dude, what if I ban Crystal again and get two bans on their belt? When your stream is loading and you think a piece banned you, that'd be a good bit. Okay, final page everybody. Final few words. Get ready to spam I was here. Okay. Is Eminem still good? Because personally, I really liked the Music to be Murdered by album. Because. Okay, Do Not Disturb is enabled. This one came up on recommended, Little Engine. I really like this single, it's really good. I might just listen to the album. Yeah, I think I only listed three people as naughty. And where's the extended version? The extended version of Music to be Murdered by goes crazy. Oh my god. <laughs> Don't show my phone. Uh, Side B Deluxe Edition goes crazy. Okay, I'm listening to the album.
Okay, Mac, be honest. If you streamed, would you ban me? <laughs> oh my god, you're texting your crush? Dude, you're in. You're literally in. Easy clap. You'd make Lemon a VIP? Would I get VIP? I'd be sad if you didn't give me VIP. Adjunct. Something joined or added to another, but not essentially a part of it. Just like my chat, not a real part of me. This is the part of me that you'll never ever take away from me. Wait, that's not. It's like. This is the part of me that you're never gonna ever take away from me. No, that's it. That was kind of flat, but I had the rhythm right. I have a lot going on. Yeah, Max, seriously, wait until you have, like, a break. <laughs> They're real just like your roommates? Shut the fuck up. I am not schizophrenic. Yet. You know what's crazy? Like, developing delusions and visions is a symptom of a major depressive disorder. So I'm just like, fuck, when's that gonna happen? <laughs> Okay, seriously, if you see ghosts as a child, you're probably actually schizophrenic. Because it, there's been studies done to a lot of people who claim to see ghosts, and like, studies in children to where it's used as a coping mechanism from experiencing trauma, and is seen a lot of kids who have schizophrenia. Smile. <laughs> That's fun! <laughs> Yeah, kind of a big oof. Not saying that you have issues, because I don't think it's appropriate to say people who have mental health issues have issues that is drastically inappropriate, but... Like, there's some people who have told me, oh, I've seen ghosts, and then it's like, I can kind of tell <laughs> that something underlying is going on. Yes, guys, the title is not clickbait, it is real. Follow the stream. That's scary, yeah, it's, it's kind of, like, sad. W when I learned that correlation, I was like, oh. Makes sense, but it's kind of sad. <laughs> My crush is so funny. Dude, why are you in the Twitch chat? Go text your crush or whatever. Go FaceTime them, I don't know. <laughs> the title is- No, the title is not clickbait. Why would the stream elements lie? I almost skipped a word. I almost threw. Adjourn. To command solemnly. To urge earnestly. I adjure everybody to follow the stream. Do you believe in ghosts? No. I never have. I think it's either people having delusions. Um, people... Because there's been a lot of instances where... In some homes that have poor regulation, or weren't built properly, or literally breathing in toxic gas. Um, so I think it's all delusions. I don't think ghosts are real. I don't believe in an afterlife. I believe once you're dead, you're dead. I'm also agnostic, so I don't have any religious... Um, what you call it? Biases is not the right word, but beliefs. 
No, I think aliens are real. I think that makes sense. Because the galaxy is nearly infinite, so why is why would there not be aliens? She pulled up research papers? No, I'm not a nerd, but it's like I'd rather look for like factual like occurrences. That's why I wear J.O. crystals? Shut up, Mac. You think your little amethyst is gonna protect you? Gotta wear a cross, you know that. Just to bring to agreement or to settle. I wear rose quartz for love. Oh, that's cute. I get anxious when I think about there being no afterlife, so I just believe there is. I think something really cute is reincarnation. I don't I don't believe in it, but I think that's really cute. Like the idea of like Loving somebody so much that way you meet them in your future life. It's so cute. It's my favorite Wattpod AU, okay? Or like you being reincarnated as like your favorite animal. So cute. I mean, but it kind of makes sense like if you um, die, then you get buried or you get burned and then you're... Your actual material goes back into the earth, so it's kind of like reincarnation. You're just reincarnated as like plants. Yeah, I don't believe it, but it's like a nice thing to think about, you know. My favorite Wattpad trope is the transfer student. Okay, my favorite tropes has got to be the soulmate AU's, like the idea of like somebody like who was meant for you. Oh my, enemies, the lovers, dude, I love that shit. Oh, I got my heart stopped, so that went away. Oh, sad, Meg. But you're gonna get that new grill. You'll be fine. Adjutant, one who assists an officer by handling correspondence and keeping records. So, an accountant? Can you stream the wedding? First, Mac has to click go live. And I don't think they're ever gonna do that, honestly. Ooh, I think my favorite single is Tone Deaf. Tone Deaf goes crazy. Oh, it doesn't have the lyrics. YouTube music, get on it. You should stream asking them out. <laughs> okay. Four more words, everybody. Four more words. Get ready. Adjuvant. One that helps or facilitates. Something that enhances the effectiveness of a medical treatment. I have a stream, I talked to my crush. Dude, that sounds like every little 12 year old's favorite video. Okay, somebody got automated. Yeah, that's fine. I don't want to creep her out. <laughs> Dude, imagine you ask her a crush and then you shove a camera in their face. I would say no. Um, okay, guys, guys. We got a stall. I actually kind of messed up. Because see, look. 
light, medium, dark, medium. That should be light. Do I reset? I don't have anything else on the back of the page, so it's totally fine if I have to reset. Should I reset? Okay, should I reset type 1? Type 1 if I should reset. Yeah, I literally couldn't tell. Not worth it. Yeah, I think it's fine. I wouldn't have- yeah, nobody said anything. Usually, you guys would be like, hey, you fucked up. But I think this is fine. It's fine. VOD watchers, you're fine. Dude, why- Mac, that's like the opening to every teen movie. You open the door at the same time your hands touch. <gasps> you get little flutters. There's literally a teen movie. Who <laughs> what pet story? I hear hell. Yeah, exactly, Mac. You're fine. You're fine. Guys, I wish I had a crush. Lib. To improvise. No, you don't. Yeah, I could change the pattern to that, but nah. I mean, don't ever feel bad if you've never had a crush. Some people are just ace, and that's fine. Some people don't like people romantically. Some people don't like people. I'm sexually, so don't feel bad. Don't feel left out. It's normal. Even if it's not as common, it's still a normal thing. And honestly, having a crush is stressful. Having to worry about people and how you look around them? Ugh. Ooh, the next two words are easy. Idea, abbreviation for administration. Like, I don't know how to ask them out. Just find one of those videos on TikTok that you see that say you send this to your crush. <laughs> Literally do that. I think the advice that Mac sent during the relationship advice stream was figure out yourself before you pursue another and i think that's good but i think it's fine to pursue a relationship if you aren't fully healed but you should never rely on your partner for support and that's something that i'm coming to understand i mean it's been years i've been an incel for years everybody but i'm still like figuring that part out you know The final word, everybody. ADM. Abbreviation for Admiral. Okay. And we're done for today, everybody. Let's see how much we did. I went from... Aquaman, right here. And then ADM. So almost a whole two pages. Damn. Let's look through everything that we did today. Yeah, everybody, you were here, you were here. After almost three hours. Oh my god, Eminem said a bad word. Can I zoom out? Oh, this is as zoomed out as my camera can go. So, acupressure. I think the blue is really pretty. The colors are really nice. 
Personally, I think A is one of the hardest letters to write. And you can see how my A's have drastically improved. I think this one is perfect. The D is kind of crooked. Adenine is pretty good. Some of the ends are crooked. Add here looks pretty good. The, that last D is kind of... Kind of off. Because in order for calligraphy to look good, your letters have to be consistent, meaning they have to be similar shape, size, consistently. You can definitely tell when there's some discrepancies. Usually, um, when you have like a double T or double L, you can see when the strokes are too dissimilar. Like, see how this bottom tail for the T is really thick and this one kind of gets too skinny? Which is the best word of the day, let's see. You're gonna be the best calligrapher in the world after this? I know! Okay, I think the best word that I see right here is acute. This one looks... All the letters are very uniform, the tails are pretty consistent. Add is also pretty good, the only thing that this second tail is kind of messy. Um, going back to the point of having two double letters next to each other, see how these Ds are really similar. And let's find another example where the Ds aren't good. Because, like, if you look here... You see, like, the inner window within the D? See how they're somewhat different sizes? You can easily tell it's a fuck-up, right? It's not majorly messed up, but you can tell when they're dissimilar. Yeah, HD camera, everybody. <laughs> yeah, the reason why it's not as crisp when it's zoomed out is because, like, it focuses on different things. But when I get zoomed in, it's gonna be, like, crisp. Yeah, I have extra books because just looking at how far this book is filled. Yes, everybody, the title is real. I filled about about a third. This is gonna take so many books. <laughs> I just realized. But yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here. Thank you to everybody who hung out and you chatters lurkers. Thank you all for hanging out today. Um, once again, thank you to Mac and Titans for helping unlock this bonus evening stream. If you're new here, click the follow button. We do calligraphy streams occasionally. They're more chill, you know, I get to chat, we get to hang out, we get to goof and up, and you get to see some nice calligraphy on screen. Wowie. <sighs> um, yeah, so I will be live on the main channel tomorrow with Amori. And I'll be live on this stream, on this channel, whenever. You know what's funny? Yeah, I'm doing a Mori on the main channel tomorrow. Exclamation main in chat, everybody. Before I go, please make sure you're following my Twitter. It's peace and underscore art on Twitter. My website will be opening in April. That way I can start selling paintings. Wow. Yeah, don't forget to clock in, everybody. Gotta get your channel points. Um, I was gonna say something else. You should ban stream elements? Why? But then, like, can't shout out donations or subs. There's one more thing I wanted to say. Yeah, thank you all for hanging out. Sorry if I trauma dumped a little bit, but you know, that's normal for these streams. So, thank you everybody for hanging out. I had fun with everybody. It's genuinely a pleasure chatting with everybody. So, yeah. Uh, oh, wait, full screen. Whoa. Full face, fa face reveal at 21 viewers, everybody. <laughs> yeah, set an alarm. If you sleep in past 10, you're an actual degen. Okay, I'll say it. Thank you all for hanging out. The funniest chat in the world. I agree. I enjoyed my stay. Thank you, Batty. Batty is now my second favorite chatter. Past 10? Yeah, if you sleep in past 10, I feel like you need to get your shit together. You should get a job, Kim. <laughs> Easy rip bozo. <laughs> nah, I understand. It's really hard to get a job. Employers fucking suck. Guys, I'm hiring. <laughs> no, seriously. I'm serious. If anybody edits, DM me on Twitter. If anybody edits, seriously hit me up. When I can afford an editor, I will literally pay you. 
Any editors? I'm begging. I'm on my knees. Okay, anything else? I think I'm fine. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye! Hire a TikTok editor? No, I like doing TikToks. And it's easy. I want somebody to do, like, graphics and shit. Okay, bye! Bye, I almost called you vanilla. Cringe. Bye, Lemon. Bye, Hacker. Bye, Kim. Bye, Crystal. Bye, Batty. Bye, Mac, if you're lurking.